but it's so hard for me, y'all. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a long time. I've been wanting to do mukbang forever. So um yeah I'm okay so before i get into like what i want to talk about um i have a shrimp po boy corn potato and just snow crab and some french fries i said my grace off camera this is my first meal today and then I have my water here. So I'm just gonna jump in. I got some of the butter sauce that came in it. So after this leg, I'm gonna tell y'all why we're here. And what's going on. Yeah, I'm gonna try not to smack like. I don't like that. But it, I don't like that. Y'all watch her. It's so good, channel. She be like, hey, oh. I told you, after I finish this leg, I'm going to tell y'all why we're here. Let's just talk. I have a serious discussion. Y'all having braces is this is probably the worst part. Um, Cause I I ain't finna use no crackers. See that's what we not finna do. I feel like cause I probably ain't gonna eat the corn. y'all like ma'am get some scissors but that's disrespectful I should have actually poured me some grape juice I don't know why I have a bag over here what are you doing? okay so I want to sit down and do this video I have been put out a video on my channel in a few weeks um y'all it's been so hard like dealing with mental health and mental illness is so real like i think it's like three o'clock now and i'm just getting out of bed i forced myself to have energy to do this I put up a dandruff video. I do I have another channel called Scratch with Tay. If you're into like the ASMR, like dandruff scratch and stuff like that. 
and I posted a video that I filmed where I talked about what I'm about to talk about now and so far like the response is like really positive um one lady was just like she was proud that you know since I'm so young like a lot of people don't like to bring up mental health Baby, I am all for mental health. I'm all for therapists. Like, I believe in God, but God wouldn't have put them here if he didn't expect us to use them. So, I noticed at, I'm just going to give you a rundown of like, my history with mental illness. I noticed that like 13, like pre, like the teenage years, hopefully YouTube don't flag me, but I used to hurt myself. Like I would notice I would get out like a hanger and like try to hurt myself, like, you know, whatever, and flip. And that started at like 13 and I noticed like growing up when I would get mad, like pain would make me feel good. Um, in 2015, I lost my grandmother to cancer. She was my rock. She was the rock of our family. Like she's everybody's rock. Um, but she primarily raised me. Um, I lived with her and my grandpa. So it hit me hard when she died. I was in college, I was a senior at the time, September 11, 2015, it was a Friday when she passed away. Um, I'm going to get a piece of this, I can't bite it. So Y'all this sauce, I don't know what sauce it is, but it's so good. Have a tattoo. Um, I took it really hard because I didn't understand how God could take somebody away from me. Um, it was selfish because she was struggling. She had battled for five years. But the selfish part of me didn't want her to go. But anyway, after she died, I did try to, you know, take my life. And I'm only kind of talking like this because I don't, YouTube flags for everything. Um, and then it happened again in 2017 when I moved to Georgia. Anytime something life altering happens to me, I kind of go into this depressive state. Um, I haven't harmed myself in two years, which is good. I'll insert pictures. You can't really tell, but I still have scars on my arm. So where I've been the past few weeks, like in my bed, like some days, I don't have the strength to do anything. I don't want to talk to anybody. I'm not going to get emotional, but it's so hard for me, y'all. Because, because you want to feel good. And, like, people don't understand, like, how much it takes to get out of the bed. Like, when your brain... When your body wants you to do stuff, but your brain is just not cooperating. When you just feel low and you feel hopeless. So I did reach out for help. Like, I, I am seeking help. Like I said, I'm a firm believer. 
I believe in God. Um, that's been the only thing that's keeping me from spiraling super low is my faith. Um, I don't know how hard this video is gonna be, but y'all like right now is is trying times like. If you're not, comment down below if you need somebody to talk to. I'm good at helping. I'm good at talking to other people. You know. My anxiety. I am. I'm not just saying I'm depressed. Like, just saying it. Because people will always want to claim stuff. I am clinically diagnosed with depression and anxiety. And so... You know, I don't know, like, well, like, I I want to feel good. Like, I, I haven't did my makeup. Um, it's just been a rough few weeks. Um, months it's been going on. I think with all this quarantine, we've been in the house. I've been in the house, and you know, I have a lot of time to think. And what's that saying? An idle mind is the devil's playground. I don't like to be a burden on anybody. But sometimes it's like the people closest to you don't always understand how you're feeling. Unless they've dealt with it. And I'm gonna say everybody. I do have a good support system. Um, my aunt has been, always been there for me. Um, I talked to my dad about it on Sunday, I think, on Father's Day. storming outside um but yeah so that's what I've been dealing with I'm very hard on myself I'm gonna try to bite this my teeth hurt um very hard on myself and Now, if you follow my community tab, you'll see um, I recently just earned my master's in education or middle grades education. I feel like I'm supposed to be excited. Nah. I'm always chasing what's next. I have realized that um, and I'm always thinking about what I'm missing. But yeah, like I haven't did any show reviews. 
I don't know if I'm actually going to continue to do those. Um, like I said, getting out the bed is hard for me. Let alone sitting and recording after a show. Uh, it's hard. Because when I was doing Insecure and um, Real House, like right now, like it's taking a lot of me. Um, Real House, I mean, Real Married to Medicine, it, um, it would be a lot for me, y'all. That's, that's as much as I, I would be having. Anxiety attack, so I don't feel like getting out of bed. So, you can comment down below. I'm trying to think of where I want to shift my channel. I don't want it to just be a drama, um, a drama channel where that's all I'm doing. Maybe. I can sit down and maybe do a mukbang once a week and talk about what's going on in the world. That one looks creepy. Um, and give like maybe hot topics. Um, comment down below though. Yeah. I'm getting food everywhere. I don't know what to talk about. Um, I'm gonna be dipping in the butter. That's why I'm just saying some of these my they be like they just be um drowning their food in butter. I like butter, but if your crabs are done right. need all that um yeah so comment down below like if you need somebody to talk to i know it's been hard for a lot of people especially with y'all Especially with all the killings and the racial injustice. I have been going to marches though. Mm. to be too long so but yeah comment down below I just said this 30 times comment down below if you need somebody to talk to any video suggestions um like I said I can always give good advice to other people but for myself But your mental health matters. You matter.
any negativity. I am subject to cussing you out because I, I have time. Um, I also want to say, like, I have been struggling with sleep. Like, going days without sleep and then only sleeping one to two hours. I was getting frustrating, so I did recently get a prescription for some sleep medicine. Seafood is so good. So I think after this, I'm gonna... y'all just take a lot of energy. <laughs> I'm not feeling it. Um, but I feel like I owe y'all a video. Probably gonna watch Green Leaf. You already saw us go. Probably gonna watch Green Leaf and what else? To catch a petition. Nothing. I had a cloth. Y'all stay safe. Make sure y'all have y'all masks. I've been seeing people out at bars, clubs. Not only risking their life, like if you will want to risk your life, by all means. But the problem comes is when you're risking other people's lives. I know people personally that have been impacted by this virus. which means I've been impacted by it. And for y'all, to be acting like it's not a big deal is a problem.
don't know if I'm smacking all if I am. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna edit this. I'm gonna probably put this out today because it's one step here. And I still got a whole bunch of hula. Do I like my nails? I mean, they're dirty. Hold on. My nails are She's in Buford. They're cute. Her IG handle is and vibe and nails and i'll put them over here girl is cold but don't be you know if you in georgia in this area don't be trying to steal her or whatever i'm not trying to show y'all the name because hey right, this ain't sponsored um Y'all just butter and got thick and cold. Mm. Y'all look at this. Wow. This is weird. Um, I think I'm done eating. Thank y'all for watching. If you made it this far, put a black fist. Cause Black Lives Matter, boo. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, do all of that. Comment down below what y'all want to see, what content y'all want. Cause I'm here for y'all. Uh, talk to me. Um. Yeah. Bye.